Please, enter. Your good work has restored us to our former strength, Ezio. We are ready to strike. Just tell me what needs to be done, and I'll see that it is. You'll approach from above under the cover of night. Emilio has posted archers around the palazzo. Kill them, but do so quietly. As they fall, my men shall replace them. What about the guards? When you finish with the archers, we'll regroup in front of this building here, and discuss next steps. Nessun problema. I'll take care of the archers and return to you. Then it's settled. In Boca Lupo. Here, friends, silks and clothes of finest weave. Come, Amici, a fresh sheep's urine and rosemary poultices for your blood. No, you don't. Well done, Ezio. Everything is going according to plan. 
As we speak, my men are replacing the archers you've removed. The way to the palazzo is clear now. But not the building itself. Emilio's guards still patrol its border. Use my men. They can distract the guards. Save you from having to fight. And when it comes time to storm the place, remember what I've taught you. Seek out, though, Ezio. We await word of your success. Your little house of cards is crumbling, Emilio. A minor setback. It will be dealt with. This povero Scemo Antonio and his thieves... Never mind them. It's the assassin you should be worried about. Why? Is... Is he in Venezia? He's been here for weeks. How could you be so blind? Unlike you, I've been busy. Someone had to provide the weapons to our brothers in Firenze. Yes. And we all saw what good that did. Enough with the barbs. What is it you want, Carlo? Maestro has called a meeting. Three days from now at Santo Stefano. Very well. I'll be there. Assuming you still live. If you want my advice, I'd find a less conspicuous place to wait. <coughs> Seta is a target. Seta is a fortress. If you say so. Goodbye, Emilio. Bazooka! You won't run what away this time! Right? You! Hold for my friend. Should be close. When it arrives, load those crates and prepare to sail. I'll be right back. If Carlos picks through, I must find a place to hide just until the meeting. Then we'll deal with the assassin. He must be working with Antonio. That means the attacks. No. I've worked too hard for this. <clears throat> Don't they understand? There is so much less crime. The people have better lives. So some must leave. It is the price of progress. Why must the assassins always interfere? Like Giovanni. If he had just left well enough alone.
Is the ship loaded? Are you ready? It is done. Take Do not be afraid. I feel no fear, assassin. Only regret. I sought unity. Stability. Order. At too great a cost. Progress demands sacrifice. Non trova alcuna gioia in questo. Ma non c'è altro modo. Requiescat in pace. Sorry, <laughs> I couldn't resist. Come, let's open the gate for Antonio. Set has fallen and Emilio is no more. All thanks to you, Ezio. Go! Tear down Emilio's banners. Return what he has stolen from the people. Tell me, Ezio. How can I repay you for your service? Money's always nice. Easy enough. What else? Emilio is meeting with a man named Carlo. He looked to be a government official. Do you know him? Carlo Grimaldi. He sits on the Council of Ten. Why do you ask? What are you up to? I have a meeting to attend. A new agreement has been signed with the Bay to ensure your safety. No, and until word returns at once from the Holy Father, the disputed lands to the south are to be excluded from all mercantile enterprise. However, merchants acting privately may do so with no fear of reprisal. Say another time. 
this is ongoing. Please be patient and do not vent frustration caused by delays at the workmen themselves. News from abroad has arrived. There is power from the Ottoman Don't carry your opinions that will be shot at the will by the populace. The bounty of all targets for hunting shall be done under the strict command of the truly industrial. What does it mean to you? I told him to be here. You told him yourself? In person? Yes, myself, in person. I'm concerned that you don't trust me. As am I. Perhaps you'll arrive with the others. Walk with me. So, how go things in the palace? Honestly, it's difficult. Mosinigo keeps his circle close. I have tried to lay the groundwork, making suggestions, but he has other voices at his ears. Then you must work hard. You must become part of his inner circle. See, si, I understand. But it's harder than I expected. And why is that, Carlo? I don't know. He just... Uh, the Doge doesn't like me. I wonder why. It's not my fault. I keep trying to please him. I learn what he craves and I have it delivered. The finest jams from the orchards of Sardinia. The newest fashions from Milano. Yes, and that's called being a sycophant. A what? What did you call me? A doormat. A flatterer. A bootlicker. Need I go on? Bastardo. You don't know what it's like. You don't understand the pressure in there. Oh, I don't understand pressure! No, you have no idea! You are a government official! I am two steps from the door himself. I am beside him day and night. You wish you could be where I am. Are you done? Hardly. You listen to me now. I am close. The Doge can be recruited. I'm sure. It's just, I need a little more time. Time is not a thing we have, you mixed plan. Don't even think. Not you. Where do you think you're going? He's getting away! Laju, he's there, on he? The are killing me. Then we sit down inside somewhere. Do you know anyone truly safe? Such a thing.
Buongiorno, cousin. Senor Carlo? We thought Emilio would be with you. Emilio is dead. What? How? The assassin. The same one who hunted down the Pazzi. He's here in Venezia. E così? Silvio, did you not know? He could be anywhere. He could be here right now and we might not even know. He struck Emilio inside his own palazzo. And so? What of our plans? There is no longer time for subtlety, my brothers. We must act now. But Marco, I am so close. A few more days, if I can just... No. It happens this week. We should keep moving. What does the Spaniard have to say of this change of plan? You can ask him yourself, soon enough. He's here? From Roma? So I've heard. Good. And perhaps he's made a decision. About what, cousin? Not in the face. About which of us shall step into the robes of the dog? I didn't know there was a decision to be made. Surely the choice is obvious to all. Obvious indeed. Should be the one who organized the entire operation. The one who came up with the idea of how to save the city. There is no lack of value in tactical intelligence, good Silvio. But it is wisdom one needs to rule. Ugh, do not think otherwise. Calma, calma, amici, please. There's no need for this. You know it's not up to either of you. For all we know, you may not even choose a barbarigo. <laughs> and why not me? I'm the one who's done all the hard work. Basta! We wait for his arrival. Are you sure? Source is coming. Yes! Signore, we should move a little faster. I feel eyes on us. Thank you, Dante. We will move at your pace. This guard's a good find, cousin. How much did you pay for him? Perhaps not as much as he deserves. He saved my life on two occasions, though he's not much of a conversation. And assassino! You won't last a with your inane prattle. The choice of Doge was never up to any of you, and you were never given permission to make plans. Forgive us, Maestro. We wish only to serve. The plan is this. Doge Mochenigo will die tonight. And once that it's been done, Marco shall take his place. We ringrazio umilmente, Maestro. <coughs> Good. Messer Grimaldi, you are closest to Mocenico. You work the most vital. Serve us well, and it won't be forgotten. Walk with me. I don't want any blood spilled, you understand? It must appear to all that he goes quietly. Certo, Maestro. When are you closest? I have full run of the palace. He may not care to hear what I have to say. He trusts me by now as one of his own. Bravo. Then I want you to infiltrate at the kitchen and poison his meal. So be it. Marco, can you furnish us with a suitable toxin on short notice? I defer to my cousin. That is really his area of expertise. Ah, Silvio. I am at your service, my son. What can you bring to get this done? I will confer with my associates in the streets.
But chances are good that I can procure some cantarella. Yes, and what is that? It is a most effective form of arsenic, and difficult to trace. Ah, la peine, la peine. Then it's the site. Forgive me, Maestro, but is this not perhaps a tad dangerous for you, involving yourself so intimately with the minutiae of our plans? I feel the need to involve myself more directly. The Pachi disappointed us in Firenze. I pray you will not do the same. Do not worry this time. The Pazzi were a bunch of foolish... The Pazzis were a potent and venerable family, reduced to rubble by one young assassin. Do not underestimate this troublesome foe, who now haunts your city. For the same fate will befall the Barbarico. I want this done promptly. Bene, I must return to Roma. Time is of the essence. Do not fail us. Idiota Sono. I should have kept my eyes on them. I need to go and see Antonio if I have any hope of salvaging this mess I've made. Salute, bello mio. Come stai? You back to see me already? Desolato, mia cara, but I am not here to play. I must speak with Antonio. It's urgent. Antonio! Ezio's here! Ezio, is everything all right? Carlo Grimaldi and the Barbarigo are in league with the one they call the Spaniard. They're going to murder the Doge and replace him with one of their own. They will have all of Venezia, their entire fleet, in their grasp. And they call me a criminal. Then you'll help me. You have me on your side, brother. 
and the support of all my men. And women. Grazie, amici. But, Ezio, I must warn you. It's not going to be so easy this time. Palazzo Ducale is the most heavily guarded building in Venezia. Nothing is impenetrable. <laughs> this is why we like you, Ezio. Come, let's go take a look. We'll come up with a plan. Business with the Doge. Terrible. Though, treachery like this no longer surprises me. When I was a child, we were taught that the nobles were just and kind. I believed it. Though my father was only a cobbler, and my mother a scullery maid, I aspired to be much more. I studied hard. I persevered. But the nobles would never have me. If you are not born one of them, acceptance is impossible. So I ask you, Ezio, who are the true nobles of Venezia? Men like Carlo Grimaldi and Marco Babarigo. No! I say we are the thieves and mercenary and whores. While we work to save this city and its people, the nobles seek to make it their plaything. We need to scout the palazzo carefully, see it from every angle. We just might find a way in. I know of a tall campanile behind the palazzo, or we might find a way to climb the back of the basilica. Do you have any ideas? I assume the front door is out. <laughs> Va bene. We'll try the front door as well, Saputello. All right, this way. So, what do you think? We're not getting in this way. They'll have time to murder the Dodge before we're able to get to all these guards. Fall in. Look at that. Archers everywhere. And the walls are impossible to climb on this side. This way.
Isn't there a decency law that applies to just such things? Bene, we're in luck. Looks like there's a perfect path up the scaffolding to the roof of the basilica. Shall we? Stay close. Ezio, look! Isn't that him? Grimaldi! Don't you understand what I'm offering you, signore? Listen to me, please. Or this will be your last chance. How dare you! I'm sorry. Mi dispiace. I meant nothing by it. I'm only looking out for your safety. We're running out of time. There's no way through this fence, and there are guards everywhere. Diavolo! Follow my lead. It's impossible. There's no way in or out for men. Only birds. Yes. Birds. Where are you going now? To see my friend Leonardo. Aha! 